Phoebe. Jacob, Lars, I've been messaging you all morning. Oh, I left my phone at home. I thought you was going skiing with those girls from uni. Oh, I had to cancel. There's just way too much to do. Oh, those exams when we get back are going to be brutal. Oh, no, I don't care about those. Look, it's my sister, Trinity. She's out in Bali with her fiancé on their pre-honeymoon honeymoon, and something awful has just happened. How about we head into town? You can tell me all about it. Her wedding plan is cancelled. Something about a row over the single estate bioorganic wine selection. And you told me your mum plans events for a living. Uh, she does. So I thought I'd come and find you and ask if she wants to take over. My dad says I'll play her anything she wants. She's dead busy. I've booked up, in fact, for the next year. Oh, I'm sure she could squeeze us in. Uh, just come with me, please. Oh, there's a cafe right here. Ah! I am so sorry. Hey. Can I help? Oh, oh, she's fine, aren't you, Phoebe? Yeah, we're, we're both medical students. We've got this. <laughs> oh, you're a university friend. Oh, Jacob can vouch for me. I'm Liam, local GP. Oh, Jacob's dad. That's right. My dad, the <laughs> doctor who lives with me, Mum, the events planner. <laughs> right, that is a nasty-looking cup. Why don't we go and sit you down? If it's OK with you, I'm just going to take a little look at it. This is so kind of you. Oh, you don't mind, do you, Dad? Not at all, son. Uh, I tell you what, just keep that elevated. Uh, Jacob, dear, would you mind accompanying me to the car to pick up my medical bag? Thanks for not lending me in it. You told your university friend that I'm your father. I met Phoebe the first day at uni. Her dad's a doctor, and I mentioned you were a GP. She just assumed you were my dad. And in a way, you kind of are, or at least you used to be. It gave me something to talk about. Jacob, I'm obviously extremely fond of you. You'll always be a part of my life, but your mother and I were split up. Yeah, and me and Phoebe are dead close. I really like her. Well, not like that, as a mate. We do stuff together. We help each other out with coursework. And she's got loads of friends, and I'm kind of one of them now. Well, and now you all know each other better, I'm sure they'll understand. What, that my life's so sad I've had to make one up? The thing about lies, Jacob, is like they're a box of chocolates. One is never enough. I know she's dead posh, but I really like her. Please, just, just patch her up. You never have to see her again. You got any painkillers in that bag? Only it's starting to hurt now. Let's get you in the cafe and get you sorted, eh? I think a hot, sweet tea's in order. <laughs> 